Hey everyone, Dom here, and today I want to show you some field equipment that you can use as a member for your podcasting needs. I'll first go over some simple setups, and then I'll transition into some more advanced setups just so you can see the wide range of options that you have. Keep in mind that this video is to show you what CMAC has to offer. Some examples I'll be going over are not definitive ways on how you may use the equipment. You may find some combinations that work better for, than others for your own productions. In terms of how to actually set up the equipment, like how to turn things on, feel free to check out our YouTube channel for various tutorials on the equipment, some of which I will point out as we go along in this video with respective links added to the description below. But anyway, let's get right to it. When it comes to producing your podcast, remember the most important thing you need to worry about is your audio, since a podcast by definition is primarily an audio show, unless you want to add a video recording, but more on that later. As a CMAC member, you have several options on how you can make your podcast come to life. So let's start with the Blue Yeti and the Rode NT USB Mini. Both are condenser mics and can be plugged into your Windows or Apple computer via USB and can be used in several programs such as Zoom or Audacity, just to name a few. The Rode mic also works with the iPad Pro with the Anchor app. Each mic has a cardioid pickup pattern, meaning it can record sounds in front of the mic, which is great for podcasting. For more information on mic pickup patterns, be sure to check out Terry's tutorial on this subject. The Blue Yeti has some additional pickup patterns the Rode does not. For example, it has an omnidirectional mode which picks up sound from all sides, which is great for a multi-person podcast, and a bi-directional mode that can record from both the front and the back, which is great for two people. So even though the Blue Yeti has some additional features, both mics are great options to consider when recording on a computer. Now what about using more than two microphones or having more control over the sound quality to make sure that the sound isn't clipping? Well don't worry, we have options for those as well. CMAC has three different audio recorders for you to pick from, the Zoom H4n Pro with two XLR inputs and its own 90 and 120 degree mic pickup pattern, the Zoom F4 with four XLR inputs and the Zoom F8 with eight XLR inputs. Each of these recorders has their own menu settings, can record onto an SD card and allow you to adjust the mic sensitivity. So feel free to experiment with any of these which can be used with our inventory of microphones. I also make tutorial videos on each of these recorders so be sure to check those out for more specific details. And lastly, we recently put together a podcasting kit which uses the Zoom PodTrack P4 which has some really cool features. As the name implies, it can record up to four XLR inputs, each with independent gain control. You can also plug in four different headphones for each of your guests and monitor the volume output. One really cool feature is that you can actually incorporate a phone call into the recording via the TRRS jack located on the side of the unit, or you can use Zoom's Bluetooth connector to connect a remote phone call via apps like Skype and FaceTime and so on. And just like with previous audio recorders, you can record on an SD card which can be inserted on the side. And that concludes this video tutorial on our podcasting equipment. I know I referenced some other tutorial videos, so those will be added in the description below. I'll catch you on the next video. Take care, everybody. If you like this tutorial, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. And be sure to check out our playlist of other tutorials. You can stay up to date on all things CMAC by following us on social media. Learn how you can become a CMAC member with access to equipment, editing tools, and other resources by going to cmac.tv.